All right, what's up, everybody? Online. This is Heritage uh, Pick Your Teams number two. Pick Your Team two. You didn't realize we we're online. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's get Pick Your Team two on camera. There, there we go. go. Boom! Pick Your Team two. Heritage. Dayton, Ohio, they have Harry's the Dayton top. Flyers, and they also have a top five lottery pick NBA player, Obi Toppin, next year. Should be Hobby Hot. Obi Toppin. Toppin or, or Hoppin? Obi Toppin. Toppin. T O P P I N. Okay, I like that. What about these uh, these long cards? Just uh, put them in loose and then we'll. Put them in the buckets, yeah. Yeah. I don't know where the remote is because we were watching Champions League and now we're watching like with a preacher or something. The Champions! We're watching something now. I'll, I'll get it. Okay. Yeah. Because I want to keep these right next to each other. So this is like, I don't know what this is. So I'll, I've got heritage, like I've got one of two and two of two. So these will be one of the tickets. Actually, Mike will take it now. Legend of Tarzan. Christopher Waltz is in the Legend of Tarzan. The 2016 edition with Alexander Skarsgård. They were really hoping this movie would take off. And like we got some big names. I'd love to watch some MLB Network baseball. If this baseball on. If it's there like is the baseball on. I don't know weirdo. Where. I don't want it. Two thirteens. Thirteens. There's a lot of people there. Teens. We've got. Yeah, oh, Dodgers are playing. Oh wait, that's on the Dodgers network. Oh wait, no, what's Prime? I think it's 691. So you you figured out right that it, the short print it'll be little right text above right head. above his head. So, so I'm gonna separate short prints. Yeah, you call them out and I'll show them on camera and then top load them. And then there are these ones that look crazy. That it's, look crazy. It's called um, French text. Oh yeah, I've seen those. Yeah, where they have like their head bursting through the card and like. Oh, they're, they're bursting through the card. Yeah, on the back of the card. They went wild this year with that. Huh? There's Pat Corbin to nine ninety nine. Yeah, kind of. French text craziness. It's crazy. It's like that song. It's trick to rock around to rock on. It's tricky. It's tricky. Hit Mitch Hanniger rally, Seattle Mariners. That's going out to Tyler Stump. Stumpy. Dustin. Yeah, 
Yeah, Taylor Ward is good. I like that they mark the short prints. I haven't seen any good. Yeah, yeah, last year I guess they did it too. I didn't even no. think about did it. Did we do it a lot of Heritage last year? I can't remember. We did Heritage High number. I remember doing that. All right. Sorry, I got it. Action short print, Mookie Betts. Guess there could be more than one in the box. Boston Red Sox edition, Jeffrey. Silver team. Missing signature. Yeah, action image. Um, the nickname, intentional errors. Nickname right. ones. We got an error of two French text, a silver team name, and some action oh, nice. in the last case. We didn't get any um, throwback or nickname, so that's what we want. The nickname is one of the shorter printed ones, I feel like. There's Glaber, the Baltimore Basher. It's the headline. What is the normal? The action is the most common. Right. And then, like, nicknames are one of the least yeah. common. Muto hot box purple. With Merrifield purple. Zach Grinsky purple. Paul De Young. Soda. There's Gio Yoshella.
You got Danny Santana, number to 999. Purple Aquino Alvarez. You got a Luis Severino for the season? Yeah, Tommy John. Tommy John. Ooh, that's the, uh, Wow. Boy, Sol Levan. Solbach not making the team. There goes that, that like, 10th pitcher spot. Could have been for you. Could have been reliever number six. And there is a bat rally of Raphael Devers, Boston Red Sox Jeffrey. I think it's a lock? No. Not CC, I don't think so. No, don't put Bias. words in my mouth. No, I'd not say... I mean, he'd probably get in, but I don't think he should be first ballot or anything. Like, well, that's what I, That's exactly what I said. He's, like, yeah. he's not first ballot. I mean, it could take... Ooh, Mitch Garver mini. That's uh, number 100. One of 100. Could take his entire, the entire... The entirety of his... His eligibility. Yuli Gurriel. Yeah, I don't think he'll like guaranteed like first ballot or whatever, but I'm sure he'll get in. He's got the wins though. He played with the Yankees so long, wins. so that's, that helps a lot. He's got a World Series. He has a Cy Young, and he has over 3,000 strikeouts. So he's got the counting stats. But I feel like there wasn't like that no, sort it, of. It was just never like the top five pitcher. Well, yeah, that's what it is. It's like it's like it's like. Like I was never scared about like my team going up against him really. Yeah. Maybe in like the postseason. But, but it was just his, his longevity. I think is. Yeah, they'll put Pete Rose in when he dies, probably. I think the longevity was the key for Sabathia. You know, what I mean, it's just like yeah. one of those guys. Like, yeah, if you if I was healthy and played in, in the MLB for twenty seasons, I could get. Right. 3,000 hits, too, or 2,000 yeah. hits, too, you know? Yeah. Like, no knock on Biggio. He's a great player, but if he wasn't on the same team for 22 years, right. you know? I don't know if he'd be as much of a lock as, as he was. Because Biggio was, like, first ballot, right? He was like first or second, yeah. yeah. He had 3,000 hits, but yeah. Jeff Bagwell, he's, did he get him? I don't think so. Right? Santana to 9.99. There's an action Arenado right next to it. Is Nolan Arenado action. For the Cockies, that's going out to... Patrick. Hey Nick, you know where the phone's at? The store phone? Yeah, the Instagram phone. No, I don't. No? It must be somewhere under the bar. Remember D.B. Cooper? Yeah, he was a person in the chat, wasn't he? D.B. Cooper. I think I want to say that they changed the, the design of almost all the plane of all the planes and the commercial planes in the world. I don't know who, like, what he did. So he robbed a. Did he rob a bank? I think he hijacked a plane, got a ton of money, and then he parachuted out of the plane. There's Keston, relic. somewhere That's allegedly country. in like the Pacific Northwest, and he they've never, never found the, the his remains, and they've never found the money. Wow. So now there's like the big mystery of, oh, did he like actually escape? Was this the greatest hijacking crime ever, or did he just die and like animals ate the money or something like that, or just disintegrated? It's like that um, Somalian plane or whatever. 
Yeah, yeah. The airway plane, the plane that was never found. And they're just like, like five, five years ago. What was that plane? Oh, it was the one in Malay the Malaysia, Malaysia Airlines? Yeah. Yeah, they say that the they think that just disintegrated a plane. I think I think it went. I I think it just disappeared. It's in there. It's like and it was just like aliens or lost. They spent so much money trying to look for it. So many countries. But I guess there was like a the thing in the plane where you were allowed to like, where you could like somehow open up a hatch and then like parachute out of there. And they said. That's wild. And then they're just like, yeah, we're we're gonna fix that. Canceling that. Yeah, we're canceling that. We're not. No one's gonna get DB Cooper again. Each row is a lot. He should be unanimous. More than each row should be more unanimous, unanimous than Rivera and Jeter, I think, because it's a baseball Hall of Fame. You know, there's Alvarez, Box Hopper, and he has stats outside of just MLB. Yeah, each row is pretty pretty lot. More of a lock than CC, I think. Yeah, I think it should be first, second ballot. I think each row should be unanimous first ballot. I think he has the most hits if you can. Kind of I think he was probably one of the first biggest Japanese hitting stars in the United States. Yeah. So I think that's going to count for, for it as well. And like nobody hates him, you know? It's hard to hate each other. Yeah. Uh, apparently, if you if you look at, um, you can look up on YouTube some commercials, local commercials Ichiro had done for the Mariners back in the day. They're kind of funny. It's like it's like watching like Kawhi do commercials in like San Antonio. Yeah. <laughs> like those are there's like a lot of funny local ads that Nitro has done over the years. Too. How's the conference? Okay. Did we learn anything cool? So, someone yeah. said there was like a lot of Ginter Chrome and like some interesting yeah. Chrome products. Ginter Chrome coming out. There's Bowman um, Transcendent. Top Stadium Club Update Chrome coming out. Wow. Stadium? Wow. Top Stadium Club Update Chrome. Stadium oh. Club Update Chrome. Yeah. So, so hopefully maybe a shorter configuration maybe? I think so. Um, Hi James, yeah, this is Pick Team 2. Jason Dominguez is going to be in Bowman with Auto. Oh, okay. That's so the that, Yankees that, prospect, right? He might go for um, like no. Thousand dollars out of the gate for a base auto. What's the Bowman Transcendent like? Party thousand dollars. I don't know what the party's gonna be. They didn't say that. Then they're doing, yeah, that. But that was announced. Nothing else crazy. Food was good. Food was pretty good. Nick approved. Chris Bryant got to meet him. And Joe Adele. Where was the Chris Bryant party? Axe throwing thing. It was an axe throwing thing? Yeah, I got some. I you got, got some good axe throwing? I got a bullseye. Did you find a hidden talent? Ooh. Yeah. I'm, nice. I think. Representing like, Jasper. They, uh, they have axe throwing leagues, like I could be in. What about all the other guys? The other guys not get a bullseye? No. They were hitting, no? They're hitting the floor. Oh, man. Things. Jaspi's representing with great axe throwing skills. I love it. <laughs> There's an action, Pete Alonzo. Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking about going. She's pro. Thinking about Did going pro. Jaspi sponsorship? Yeah. Alright. All right. Look at this. This is my dad. How did he do? He's a two hander? Oh, that's not a bad throw either. Are you supposed to two hand it? Yeah, they taught two handed and one handed. I was more comfortable with one hand. But yeah, he was throwing two. It was like kind of an unorthodox throw by him, but it, it stuck. But hey, you know what? Sometimes there's hitters or pitchers the, on off one unorthodox. It's easy to get the axe yeah, to the that. target. It's hard to get the axe to stick in the target. That's the gotcha. difficult part. Am I putting any of this up for the other stuff? Yeah, um, just add like $10. Okay. I think the prices should be in this showcase. Okay, cool. For both, right? Yeah. And yeah, I don't know if the Instagram's gonna work, so you might have to stream on Hermosa. I don't know. It's really frustrating about that Instagram. What are these? 
those those are ready to go for you to look at. Joey Gallo. I don't understand how to call a bar. Jeffrey Goldberg. What's that? I don't understand like what a bach is. I mean, I know what it is, but yeah. I don't know how I would call it. Like, if I was an ump, I would never know. Uh, that's pretty clear. Uh, okay, I guess. I guess maybe it's the ones where, like, when you when like lefties go to first, yeah. There's like there's a forty five degree angle that they can't go past, and that like Julio Urias almost gets called for could get called for that almost every time because it's so close. You have gone through those? Yeah, but I think you did already too, right? No. Um, I'll do it again. Just to make sure. Will Beltran not get in because of the cheating thing? I know Altuve will never get in. I think Beltran never gets in. Why? Because of the, just because of his career, or because of the, specifically because of specifically because of cheating. Because of cheating. I think he'll he'll get the roids treatment. Bonds and McGuire. Wow. So so. Yeah. I think so because. Not only there's was he Luis part of Alvarado it, but buyback. A lot of people consider him the ringleader. I thought that was Cora. It was Cora then Beltran pushing on the players? I think Cora. Well, I don't know. They haven't finished the investigation with the Red Sox. But. I know they saw him hit the punishment. But the the first report made it seem like Beltran was one of the biggest ringleaders of it. Yeah. And then all the Astros tweeted about Salty because they were just like, oh the. Players are too scared, you know, to like say no to Beltran, and, and they were like, "No, we weren't. We cheated fair and square." Although I don't know Beltran's numbers off the top of my head, Sean Corbett, do you have do you have Beltran numbers for us? Joe Dell's gonna be a monster. Some, some, counting, say that. some counting stats. We saw him in the game before the conference. Oh yeah. Yeah, he's gonna be a monster. What what facility was near where you were at? Tempe Diablo, the Angels. Oh, the Angels one. Yeah. It's, but the hotel's like like 15 minutes away from that. But there's no other stadiums really near it. So you got Joe Adele and then Chris Bryant at the Astros. Yeah. Did Chris Bryant throw any axes? No. I, I, I imagine Scott Boris won't let him know. <laughs> Scott's just like, Chris, I know you're doing this thing tonight. Please do not throw an axe. Don't get in front of an axe. Don't take a picture with an axe. Yeah, like they had they had to separate him like a cage because there was axe throwing right next to him. Did he, uh, did, did you like talk to him or was he no, cool? No, like they were shuffling through. Oh, there Joe, was... that was cool. He asked, I said I'm an Angels fan. And he said, that's cool, who's your favorite player? I said, well, Mike Trout. And he's like, yeah, he's my favorite player, too. <laughs> like, and then I said, I like to call count him, too. And he's like, oh, you must hate me then, right? I was like, oh, <laughs> oh he's sassy, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because, I mean, if they you know, that's like, why they let him go, you know? That's yeah, right. I know. Like, yeah. And he's like, yeah, that, you must hate me then. Where is Joe Adele from? Um, I did look it up. I forget now. He's only 20, though, so it's kind of crazy. Louisville, Kentucky. Wow. Kentucky. A Kentuckian. There's a yellowish action, short print. 
After this is uh, pinning you one, pick your team one. We have to do the number block first. And then once I finish this break, I'll be posting the number block um, for pick your team two, four left. So if you want one of the last four teams, you should grab them. Pick your team three is eight left. So probably Panini one, two, three, four, five, six will all go tonight because they're all really close. Looks like TriStar Quest is pretty close. That's going to go tonight. Dynasty Baseball will go tonight. I'm hoping we can fill up that Spectra Football to get at least. Yeah, well, I want to get that promo done. That promo close. Dynasty's almost sold out. It's eight left. Oh, that's a promo break. No. Uh, it is, yeah. So then we just have the Spectra and the 2017 and the Mahomes. Suzuki, Kurt Suzuki, white border. There's Mike Dostrzemski, Fractor, for the San Francisco Giants, number 571. And there's, a, I think, our first autograph, Brandon Lowe. Brandon Lau, for the Braves, EA. Yeah, I think he's Lau. Lau. And then he his teammate, Nate Lowe. Nate Lowe. That's what I'm saying. I think so the Bach made it five, and then I think there was another run. Yeah, and then there's some confidential info I can't say on air that was discussed. Uh, the top conference? Yeah. Got some dirt, got some juice, wow. you know, gossip. Got some uh, new stuff that I heard. What was the uh, top swag that they gave us? There it was like a backpack. Alonzo, I got a lot of nice stuff. They were supposed to give us blankets. Oh, tops blankets, a cozy tops blanket. But she said, "Yeah, you guys need tops blankets," and but we ran out. So what? Didn't get the tops blanket. We had a nice backpack the other year. Yeah, they didn't, they gave us a string bag this year. Would have taken that blanket then. Yeah, blanket. I was really disappointed. Though. I think right, like, because right away, he said, "Oh, our names are spelled wrong." Oh no! Oh, yeah. So then, I think they might. Decades have said, in the industry, they can't get your guys' name. Well, right. well, then I was like, "Well, we're not getting those blankets now that we need to correct that." Oh. <laughs> They'll conveniently run out. Yeah. But I think we got like a sippy cup. Do, 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 do. 
that so they're putting a street light. The construction workers blocked that street there. I had to go right. It was all I was all just confabulated. I don't think they're doing that. That's what he said. I know, but he does say things. He went out. And, <laughs> like he's he'll say whatever he wants it to be there. Like he'll put in his just head. Put put it. Talk. Speak it into existence. Yeah. Oh, it was, are those, sorry, Sean, I just saw Beltran's numbers there. Man, I'm surprised that 1718 Prism, so his, so Jason Tatum's PSA 10 Silvers were about $500 last week, and, and then ever since his off. recent performance, $1,000. Oh my god. They've doubled. Should we double the price of the break? I guess. <laughs> I thought that would fly too. I'm shocked that that's not going. A little quicker. I posted it yesterday, I think. Or I mean, he's had like 35 points a game for like the last week. And the, I mean, it's not like the Eastern Conference is stacked. They could make a run. Posey, Buster, Michael A. with the Giants. Buster Posey's first ballot hall thing. And so they didn't have the batting averages? My dad was mad about that. They don't show the batting averages on the Tempe Diablo Stadium for the players. They oh, show OPS they and they show um, OBP. And he said both of those stats BS. Wow. He doesn't believe in wow. them. Wow. Take that for data. He doesn't he doesn't like those stats. Yeah. He, he said, "If you get intentionally walked, it counts as on base percentage." He, so I'm he, like, would, yeah. he would be. He would not be managing in the modern MLB. No. Or else he'd just be like the face of the team, and then, <laughs> right. and then like the guys upstairs, like we'll just be setting my notes. It's like that David Ross or like Dusty Baker or something. Take that for that. I was like, OPS is like, you know, OPS is stat. Pretty. It's like, but yeah. they didn't have batting average up there. I was shocked. I was like, wow, it's a lot different than when I used to go to baseball games. They're showing war. They're not batting average, though. Nobody cares about batting average. I'm surprised they didn't put, like, run WRC plus on there. Some runs created stats on there. Hansel Robles, white border. I mean, you should have you should have told your dad. You know what? Why even have a scoreboard? Let's just score it ourselves, like back in the day. Yeah. You know. I like scoring games. You, know, you didn't have fancy scoreboards back in the day. You just have to pay attention and figure it out. Pop open the newspaper. See what Joe Jackson was hitting. Do you know who led the AL in home runs last year? Led the AL in home runs last yeah. year? No idea. American League home run theater 2019 season. You don't know? You were on Alvarez? Jorge Soler. Jorge Kansas Soler? City, Kansas City Royals. There he is right here. Jorge Soler. Yeah. 48, 48 home, runs. home runs last year. Led the league. Sosa should be in. Jorge only needed until September 3rd to break the single season record for homers by a hitter on the Royals when he launches 39th. He more than doubled his total over prior five seasons. Boy. Go. Sammy Sosa. Just Jorge Soler went to like a swing camp over the summer. Tug McGraw. 1971 original card. Yeah, I think Sosa should be in, but steroid guys, I don't know if they'll ever get in. He's not getting in before Bonds or McGuire, though. So. Well, once the once like one of those guys, once that domino falls, I think. Yeah, but eventually it'll run out, right? What do you? Ha how many years do you have on the ballot? Ten. Or you have to qualify. Ten, ten times. Well, Bonds has been on it what seven or eight times. But is it if you qualify at a certain yeah, that, percentage? That I don't know. I think you have to get like at least twenty percent. Twenty percent, yeah, something low. Like stay that. on it every year. Fifteen, twenty percent. Then you can be eligible for the following year. And guys like him and Clemens and stuff have just been. Kind of on the fringes for a while. Anthony Benboom. Never heard of him. 
Ben Boom. It's like Boom. It's like uh, they were the rivals of the Key Booms back in the day. Across the street. Yeah, Ben Booms and the Key Booms. There's a guy in the Angels, Anthony Ben Boom. It's like Hatfields and McCoys. Ben Booms and the Key Booms. It's like um, him and Carter, Key Boom, were enemies. It's like the Tannins and the Flies. Yeah, like the Tannins, exactly like the Tannins and the Flies. Yeah, bottom should be first ballot. If Otto was on New York, yeah, he would he would be a beloved first baseman. Uh oh, Astro celebrate. Is that where? Uh oh, is that where he didn't take off his shirt? That same photo. That's funny. I think so. Is this 2019? Yeah, this is yeah. it. Well, apparently, he went downstairs in the dugout, changed, and his, changed shirt, his shirt, and then yeah. came back. For the interview? Right. Don't take my shirt off. And then everyone was... Uh, Bellinger, obviously, but a lot of other major leaguers were like... Eh. We need a short print. We haven't caught one over No, I've, I've not seen any short prints either. Where they at? Like, I haven't seen any of the... F the French ones should be really obvious, right? Yeah, those are really obvious. No, I haven't seen anything else. This one's glossy on your back. That is weird. I don't think that's anything. I think it's normal. Huh. It's weird though. It would say if it's a short print of any kind. Yeah. Is it a high number? What's the top? Two forty three. No. Where did the high number start? Three four hundred one. Four hundred one. Yeah. It is mustache. Wow. Wish I could grow mustache. Jemai Jones. Yeah, he's good. I saw him play. He's really fast. It's not a ton of power. What's the what's the buzz around Joe Madden in Arizona? Everyone love him? Yeah. People like that. He's pretty solid. The weird feeling one is a flip stop. see it on the short print list, but maybe it, it's uh, another thing. There's just so many little things, that's why we're shipping all cards this year. Here's the flip stock. It was uh, Aaron sure. Sanchez, the former Blue Jay. See, I don't think they're anything special. Oh. oh. Action. Wow, that's nice. Gavin Lux, rookie action. It didn't look like a lot of action. I thought though. you meant it was. That's what I'm saying. I don't get the action sometimes. Um, I thought it was another flip stock. I was like, there's no way. This box is weird. There's a lot of cards upside down. There's Bobby Bradley, rookie autograph for the Cleveland Indians. Going out to Ian. Dylan Bundy? What do you mean, Bundy's? Al Bundy? Top loaded. Top loaded, it's safe. Yeah, Dylan Bundy's pretty good. First start, like, ace? Second ace? I don't know. Dylan 
Alan Bundy getting out of the AL East is probably good for you guys. Just had to score 10 runs every game. Yeah. Well, change is probably good to do, actually. Yeah. And Otani needs to be an ace. When is Otani scheduled to start, Sean? He's, put, he's not going to start the season pitching, right? He is. Really? But I think they're 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 doing the program a little differently this year. I think he's only doing like Sundays or something like that. That's right. Yeah, yeah, I heard that. But I just didn't know if it was like right in March, April. Yeah, he's gonna pitch every Sunday. Or like that. See why not? There's Clayton Kershaw. I actually want to go. Do we we, didn't, we haven't seen him pitch, right? We saw him. I hit. saw his first ever pitch. In the oh, you did? Yeah. yeah. The game we went to the other summer, I think we only saw him hit. Yeah, yeah, that's the, right. The three of us went yeah, to Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we just saw him hit. But you are but yeah, you but you went to his first start. Yeah. Mother's Day or Father's Day or something. Yeah, maybe he'll start in like May. I don't know, I don't want him to rush him. Really, no need to. Yeah. The AL West, I don't know. The Astros are gonna be good, but and the A's are always like, like, spicy. Good. Yeah. But the Mariners should be pretty bad. So I don't know. Beat up on them. Uh, probably about, uh, Panini 1 should be probably about 30 minutes, 30, 40 minutes from now. Joe has to do the number block and then break. Probably about half an hour to 40 minutes. David Ortiz is like kind of fringe steroids though, right? I think, I mean, I'd like... I just think the star guy should be in at this point, but so I'd say yes to him. I like Manny Ramirez a lot too. I don't know what his stats are like though. I don't think they're good enough. The injury got them later in his career. Yeah, there's only three teams that don't have any hits in one. And we took them all out, so. And if anyone bought one of those teams, we would refund them already. It's just the Bucks, Bills, t uh, Texans. The rest of the teams have hits. But yeah, it's kind of weird. Usually Panini includes all 32. Yeah, they're usually throwing some money. Yeah, it's usually like the other teams might have just one player. I think the Titans might have one or two. All right, we're going to Daniel Vogelbach, Mariners, to 9.99. Action to Tease Jr. Action Tatis Padres that is going out to William yeah I mean it's not a product that they made a lot so some guys are going to have only a couple hits but yeah I mean Lions who else are you going to put other than Matthew Stafford and Barry Sanders, and Barry Sanders? maybe find some old Megatron it's like two Hall of Famers so I guess Calvin Johnson but autographs. if they don't sign you know currently right. It's not like honors where they can buy him back. You know, this is like live signatures. And it's just a one hit per box. One right, hit there's no per base cards or anything. Right, so. And yeah, I think they try for this release, they try to only include the top name rookies. So like TJ Hawkinson wouldn't be in it. They try to include like the best quarterbacks and 
Since it's yeah, a hundred dollars. I don't know why they twenty five dollar product. Right. No. I think Devin Singletary must have come on too late for them to put him into Yeah, production. and I mean That's even like a single Devin Singletary for like hundred and forty bucks probably wouldn't get too many people excited. Stafford is a Hall of Famer, Matt. Uh, Sean. He says his stats are insane. Gold oh, yeah, that's French. Oh, this is the French one. Yeah. It is. Anthony Descalfani French for EA in the Reds. Stafford's stats are insane. He, I mean, he'll be a Hall of Famer, I guarantee it. Q Vanilla Gorilla in the chat. Why, he's a Stafford hater? I or hate fan? Stafford. He's a Lions fan? It's kind of. I think he lives in Atlanta now, but... Relic of Reese Hoskins? But I think he was born in the Detroit area and just... Michael Jones? Hates Stafford. Yeah, Aaron, I, I agree. I think he's kind of underrated. But I think he's, I think he's a little I mean, too. unless his injury is really bad, I don't think they should move on from him this year. Just let him see how his contract. Yeah. I mean, he has... How many seasons of 5,000 passing yards? I mean, like, with, Drew Brees has done that. With, I mean, not not too many name receivers. Yeah, I mean, he had Calvin Johnson. I saw your, and uh, Trendsetter, I saw your your collection on Twitter, too. It was really nice. Yeah, that was nice. I retweeted that. I like the, the glass case that it was in, too. That was cool. I like the football in there. And yeah, football Hall of Fame is a lot easier than baseball, I think, I think, to get in. I think they make it a little easier. Do they? Yeah. I, I feel so. like they don't... Oh, I feel like it is, but qu like quantity-wise, they don't put in many people every There's year. Bob Gibson? No, they do. There was like eight people. Oh, yeah. I guess so. Like, I mean, and they'll put in like kickers and, you know. Like offensive linemen, how do you determine? There's no that I don't. I have stats. I don't know football well enough. Like basketball is pretty easy, yeah. Well, yeah. Basketball, football, baseball, I think is the toughest. I went to the basketball hall of fame before, in Springfield, Massachusetts. The hall of fame. I need to go to Cougar Town. I think he's gonna be. Yeah, I've been to Cougar Town. You don't want to go in Jeter's there, though. Way too many people. No, not for a Hall of Fame, just to go. Oh, just to go. Yeah. yeah. Like. Yeah, Cooper sounds cool. I've never been to Canton. Like, he's not like to go there. If we go to the National, yeah. Atlantic City, that could be a good excuse to maybe swim over like Cooperstown for drive. a couple days. Is it? No, it's not. Yeah, it's insanely far. Okay, I'll have to. You have to fly. Yeah. I don't know where you fly into, though. Rochester. Yeah, I went there once. It was cool. I don't remember it too much, but... I'd like to go on a Hall of Fame weekend, but apparently it's so hard to get room. Yeah, I think there's only, like, three hotels there. Yeah. I'm sure people, like, Airbnb their houses out there. Yeah, They're, Airbnb like, colonial-era houses yeah. for, like, a zillion dollars. Or you just get, like, a... You just rent an RV or something. That Angels post game of a March spring training game. But you don't want to, you don't even break down the spring training game. Uh, I don't know what else we have though. Two thirteen. Oh, I guess it's like more baseball. MLB Network. Yeah. You give us Oakland at White Sox or something like that. No, that. Oh, Nationals, Nationals Yankees. Yankees. All right, all right. Get some respect on their name. Yeah. Yeah, they called them the Martian. Jason Dominguez because I guess he's just like insanely ripped and stuff. So that's what Tops called him. The Martian? The, the alien or the Martian? One of those two. That's his nickname, I guess. But it's not though, right? <laughs> it's not free. Phil Rivers a Hall of Famer too. But John no Duplantier. No, no one's doing your taxes for free. Taxes. Is he 
you on the main Instagram? I don't like this guy. I don't like the Old Spice guy. The old school Old Spice guy? Thing? No, the, I, I don't like this guy. New? New guy. Oh yeah, he's on the main one. How's it looking? I don't know, I guess it's working. It was working for Teddy for the first few hours, but then it stopped. But it's been three days, so... You know, God, help. God help save us here. I think Justin Upton should have a better season two this year, so... Angels... Um, lineup is pretty, pretty low, but... Remember when Justin Upton put it in the paint bucket? Yeah, and then... And then no, sure. well, it bounced, technically. Off a of bounce, but it still went in? It still went in, but then they didn't donate the and money. And Sherwin-Williams was just it's like... It's like, how many millions of millions yeah. of dollars profit? To just say, it's just bad PR. Bad PR. Never buying That Sherwin, was ridiculous. Never I'm buy never buying Sherwin-Williams. Sherwin Even Trump. though they're the official paint sponsor of, of the, the Los Angeles Angels, you just can't do it. A different paint bucket next year. Labor Torres, Relic, Contract runs out. Yankees, Evan. Bill Ripken, aka the most one of the most famous cards. Billy Ripken. There's Chapman. Matt Chapman. Number to $9.99. That is Anthony Rizzo, consistent power threat. Three boxes to go. Should be about 20, 25 minutes until Panini warms. Um, what's up, Don? Yeah, the Bills don't have any hits in Panini One. They don't have any cards in the checklist. So we refunded you for that. The Bills don't have any cards. The Houston Texans and then the uh, Tampa Bay Buccaneers. No cards whatsoever. Yeah, no problem. But yeah, all your other teams are, are still good. I believe so. See a nickname short print or maybe a missing signature. Yeah, nothing. They've got no or no nickname. Uh, the old bouncing the baseball, throwing the baseball off the wall. Still a classic exercise. Uh, yeah, the bills are free, technically. Tim Lang said you want us to put your name throughout all the bills. Although, if we do a giveaway, then people get mad. Ooh, Starbucks. Wow, nice advertisement there. Co coffee Juggernaut is born. There's Verlander. Born in 1971. I wish Bobby Brady made the Hall of Fame, but that thing's not going to. There's a Al 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 
Alzole. Yeah, I, got, I have trouble with that name. Corner. It's Adbert, not Albert. It's Adbert Alzole. Yeah, it, the L should be, should be there, there, and the D should, you think be, should there. be there. Albert Adzole. Adzole. Is what I keep wanting to say. 001 of 571. First one ever made. There's Garrett Cole. He definitely needs some facial hair there. Looks weird. It does look weird. Looks really weird. I don't know if that's Photoshop. I think that's a short friend here, Bryce Harper. No. I thought I had gotten one. They didn't do the silent auction this year. I was hoping to bid on my own gifted card. What did that go for last year? Like fifteen thousand grand. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I got a love. We got some new Pokemon. We got to put those on the shelf. Whoa! We got new Pokemon. Yeah, in? it's like Pokemon Toxtricity. All right, all right. Toxic, tox. You gotta get it. You're like. I wish they had numbered Pokemon Tim. I wish they had like NT Pokemon, you know, Tops, Tops Chrome Pokemon, Prism Pokemon. But I don't know why they don't do serial numbers or anything like that. I think people must use them to play the game itself. I know, but don't people also collect them? Just to collect? Yeah, I think yeah. so. Like no one's playing with vintage po like. A yeah, I guess not. Ten thousand dollar Charizard. There's Archie Bradley, white border. Yeah, we we'll look at how that works. I think the Reds could be could be good with Castellanos. They got they sell they Trevor. Great they got staff, Trevor too. Bauer. Yeah, Luis Castillo. I think they could. Hot take is winning the division. A couple people in the chat have mentioned that too. Nick Senzel. You should be to look at. I only had like one auto this year. Two autos? Looking for another auto here. What's up, hey, hey? Hey, hey, what's going on? I don't think they're going to do Chrome Heritage. They're doing Chrome Ginter. And regular Ginter? And regular Ginter. I don't know when the Chrome Ginter is scheduled to come out. Um, they didn't have a release date. And that was pretty much the only new product. That, Bowman Transcendent. The Transcendent Tennis, which they said they have Federer autos. Whoa. They have Naomi Osaka autos. Um, and then all the greats. I don't think they can get Serena because she's upper deck, but Federer is going to be monster, I'd imagine. I mean, to get a nice, like, on card, like, Federer autograph. And there's our next auto, Anthony K. Blue Jays. Let's go out to John. Yeah, uh, like a because I feel like all a lot of his leaf stuff, unless you got a really short print, we're all like stickers. Yeah, and it's not it doesn't have the brand. Right, transcend it does. And the invite is like a to the International Tennis Hall of Fame or something, oh. like a huge party Ooh. where there's supposed to be players and Honoring stuff. Honoring some players, that's yeah. kind of cool. 
So I think we, we might do a tennis or two. Um, we'll, I'm sure we'll do a few Bowman Transcendents. We have the Transcendent Hall of Fame we'll be doing. And then at the end of the year, Transcendent Baseball. And all the breakers were there. They did a breaker thing, so we gave them a lot of feedback on how to improve Transcendent and make it a little more interesting. Oh, what were some of the good some ideas? Some of the things, it's like, you know, it's nice to get all the autographs on a checklist, but it kind of ruins some of the, the fun. You know, because, like, you already know what so autographs you're going to get, you know? So if they, more surprise if they expanded the checklist a little bit, and then you get, like, 50 of the 70 names instead of... 60 of 60 names, you know? Something like that. Marie Sharapova was still playing? I don't know that. She's still playing. So this is a randomizer between... Oh, no. Is she she just retired? Is that what... Officially? So this will be, um... A part of the one, two, three randomizers we'll do. It's kind of crazy. I know she's battling a lot of injuries. She used to live right up the street, man. Really? Mm -hmm. In her hay, yeah, she was she was living on the hand beach for a while. And she did like steroids or something. Action Clayton Kershaw. Um, there's Devers. Yeah, she got suspended I, for a while. I think it was for like Clayton a year. Kershaw yeah. action. I think it was like one of those like oh like my doctor prescribed me this supplement. Yeah. And like it was fine for the. Yeah, that's this, but excuse. it wasn't for that, and I didn't know, and... Final box, good luck. So it was one of those things, and they're like, okay, sure, okay. Sure. I need to take one of those to Phoenix, man. The Freedom Traveler, it's got a TV. Whoa! We, we need it's to get a bed. Wow. There. We need to get this jaspy RV here. We've got a little patio there with lots of meadows. I wish we get one of those. That was such a bad trade with the pirates. For the pirates. Yeah, it's stupid. Flaz now and meadows. And meadows yeah, hits for 90 Chris Archer. Home runs. And they weren't even competing, so why would they need that? I don't know here? why they did that. That's. I get it. Race could be really good this year. They got G-Man Choi. That's right. <laughs> awesome Meadows. You've seen him hit some plus homers. I guess they just didn't think they would do this. Yeah. And they looked at Awesome Meadows was like really hot for a while, and then he kind of cooled. Like he was in the minors for a while. And they looked at the they looked at the Archer contract, which is apparently incredible. It's like you yeah. get like. Five more years of team control and blah, blah, blah. So I think they were looking at it from a value play. Yeah. But they're not so competing. I think they're thinking, here's a solid, like, Chris here's a solid number two or three pitcher yeah. for a rotation for pretty cheap. But he was he just like he's just really for two bad. prospects. Yeah. Is what they were thinking. So it would be like Tyon, Jameson Tyon, and Chris gets, Archer. They thought it would get some some people in the park. Yep. And then. And then the worst case scenario happened. Those two guys like balled out. <laughs> yeah. There's Xander Bogarts, Relic. What's up, Mothro? Uh, Boston Red Sox. Mothro, what up? Jeffrey. Um. Yeah, to get a Chrome card, he did get a Ginter card, Tim. But yeah, the Chrome card, we all want. That's why I wanted to be in this year's Ginter because get get a little Chrome, get my own Super Fractor. Whoa. Kind of sick. Whoa. Nick, you asked me super frat? That'd be awesome. There's a Bryce Harper action short print. So it should be done with hits on this box. Um, maybe another short print in here. But Come on, short prints? No autos or... Uh, Relic. Here's a Ryan Presley to $9.99. No nicknames? No 
color swaps, no team. So, oh, yeah, triple auto, that'd be kind of nice. Get some break worn materials in there. Like these shirts that we're wearing? Yeah. Get the logo. Oh man, if you got like a little palm tree That'd be sick. on that, and maybe like a little S or the P of Jaspies or something like that, ooh. That relic would be pretty strong. those as, as well and then we're doing the left right ones and then we're doing the top bottom ones which I got one right here same team but you guys get the point all right so that's a break we got the one last 1971 original card here might have some more heritage on the site I'm not sure but definitely not today or tomorrow we want to get these at least sorted out and stuff before we bog them down even more. Um, Jason is does have personal heritage for a pretty good price, I think, on Instagram if you wanted a whole box. And if you want more baseball, we have Dynasty Baseball almost sold out. All right, the original is Jim Schellenbach. The Senators. The Senators became the Rangers? Which the Senator old Senators. Nash twins? No, so that's that's seventy one, right? So yeah. that would be Rangers, I think. Rangers, all right. It was uh, like what's the, up, TJ? It was like the Kilbrew era senators that turned into the twins. Right, 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 right. Oh, keyboard. Um Yeah, you don't want the extra sweaty swatch, definitely not. You want it on like a Panini one break, not heritage. Do you feel you have, what's up Nick? Um, do you feel you have the same odds of hitting low number parallels in a box of optics? TJ, what's hobby? up? Oh, Links is here too, hi Tim. I'd imagine the odds of hitting a low numbered is a lot better in the hobby. Joe just hit a number to five Zion. Was that yesterday? Mm -hmm. The rookies insert. Which I don't know if that sells as well as the regular It doesn't sell as well as the base, but it'll still go, for, I think, go for thousands. Couple, 5,000 plus, five, right? 5 to 10, maybe? I don't know. I think what might help is that there's none on this. I, I didn't see any on eBay, anyway. Yeah. Alright, so the... Dice roll for all of these cards seven times. The first one is top bottom, so it'll look like this top or bottom seven times one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Goes to the bottom there. Next one is the left and right for the horizontals. I don't have any examples of that, but I'm Pretty sure we pulled at least one. So it'll go to either left side or right side on the horizontal cards. Two, Strong side. three, four, five, six. Five, six, and seven. Goes to the left. Next one is one, two, three. So use this one for example. Mark color on the top. And then right in the bottom left there is Dave McNally. That would be the number two. And then the bottom right is Jim Perry. That would be the number three in this example. One, two, three. We four, are the Titans. Five, six, and seven. Mighty, mighty Titans. I just saw that again. Recently. Three. Remember the Titans? Yeah. It's pretty solid. And then the last one is one, two, three, four. Strasburg on the top. That's one. Uh, Max Fried in the bottom left, that's two. Dakota Hudson, bottom middle, that's three. Kershaw, bottom right, that is four. One, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven. Two spot. So there you go. Thanks, everybody. That was Heritage Baseball Pick Your Teams number two.